weed and the light. Oh my God, I'm talking too freely, but you know. It, it, the change of stories, the lack of preparation, the lying, the holy <laughs> But he's appealing to the base. What they're doing with the kids at the border. I mean, I, mean, I guess. I mean, he, he, he's, he, but he was a tough kid, right? He was a brat. Yeah, yeah well, that's what I mean. I don't mean tough. That all. I said I mean to a brat or temper tantrum. I, I drove him around New York City to try to get him into college. He ended up in Florida. I got him in somehow. Um, before, before I had any real Catholic roots. Right. Um, but he, I mean, I didn't get him in. But, but he, I know he didn't get into college. And uh, he, uh, and he went to Fordham for one year, and then he got into University of Pennsylvania. I guess he had somebody to, to take his take the exams. <laughs> no way. And he had somebody take his entrance exams? SATs or whatever. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> That's what I <clears throat> believe. I, I, need, I even remember the name. Oh, man. But then he, you know. I mean, that's but a shot. No, but right. now when you do what he does stories, he never mentions Fordham. Of course not. Oh, my God. No, he went to the Wharton School, which also isn't true. He didn't go. He went to the University of Pennsylvania. Yeah, the University of Pennsylvania. And took a couple of classes, I guess, at Wharton. Oh, that's insane. That's him. So, and, and he knew you over, I did his homework for him. And he said, did you watch Fox News? I said, no. Why not? I said, I don't watch much television at all. Pause. What do you do? <laughs> I read. Pause. What do you read? Books. You don't watch Fox? Mm -hmm. yeah. And Donald was, Donald's out for Donald, period. When, when he said, he started to say something to me. Boy, look at what I've done for you. And I've said, you have done nothing deliberately. I have never asked him for a favor since 1981 when I was being highly considered to go in the federal court on my own merits. I never used the name Trump. Mm -hmm. It was never part of my makeup. Right. Um, until John and I got married, I had to make the transition. But long story being short, um, Reagan was the president. And can you ask Cohn, Roy Cohn, to call Reagan? Because they were like kissing buddies. Um, the next day I had the nomination. Uh, I probably would have gotten it on the merits. Anyway, Reagan was running for re-election. He needed a woman. A woman, yeah. And I was top government prosecutor in the United States. So yeah. I had to take credit for me. Well, you're, where would you be without me? I said, you want to, you mention what? You say that one more time, I will level you. Jesus. Because in 1981... He had Roy Cohn call Reagan, who had to be a woman appointed to, the, you know, in New Jersey to a federal court, because Reagan's running for re-election, and he made, he was desperate for the female vote. I mean, or, I said, you had Cohn make one phone call, and I've done everything since then. Did you make Chief Justice Rehnquist appoint me to head criminal judge? No, he didn't. No. I, you ever mention that one more time, any, I will wipe you out, and I would.